Hi everyone, it's me Darlene. I am finally ready, I think, to try on some shirts. I don't have as much time today as I would like, but I, I want to get this going. I have uh, nine thrift store shirts to show you, and then I'm going to show you a three that I got from my friend Jeannie. She gave me a bag of shirts, and I've only been going through them a little at a time. And the first few that I picked, I really liked, and I altered them, and I'm going to show them to you also. I'm not going to show you all the shirts she gave me. I haven't even seen them all yet. I'm just going through it a little bit at a time, but anything that I pull out of there and I wear out, I will show it to you uh, in the next try-on video. Okay, so um, my thrift store is Park Ave Value Store in South Haven, Mississippi, and uh, it's off 51. And I know there are some others here in Mississippi and some others, I think, in Georgia. I, I don't know why that doesn't stick with me. There is another state. So you can always search for Park Ave Thrift Store or Park Ave uh, Value Store, which is the actual name. And I only shop um, for the things that are half price. You have to sign up to get a text from them and it will tell you you can buy anything in the store except a certain color. That certain color will be full price. And this doesn't apply on Sundays. So I go Monday through Saturday. I go often. And I only shop for the tags that will give me half price. The most I paid for any of the shirts you are about to see is anywhere from 91 cents to like $1.96. I don't pay more than that for any of the shirts. And I think I'm ready to get started. Yes, I just trimmed my bangs and I tried to keep them as crooked as possible with little wispy things hanging down. Did I, did I do good? What I did is I, I trimmed this layer a little shorter. <laughs> and uh, you guys are obsessed with the weirdness of my hair. I kind of like that. Okay, we're gonna start with this that I've worn several times. And I, I altered it, but not like in a permanent way. You may remember this. Uh, all of these shirts were in um, thrift halls that, you know, I show you in my car. Okay, so I really liked the print. Here's what I did. Um, was there a cuff? There's like a slight cuff, but I didn't cut it. But I rolled it up and I pinned it because I was in a hurry to go out and that's what I did. And then the um, neck is, I did this one, I think I looked differently. No, I just folded it and pressed it and I undid one more button. <laughs> and um, again, I pinned it. There were some pins on the inside. No, I actually tacked this one with thread. So it just, uh, instead of having the neck go more like up, it's uh, more V, and I like that. Whoa, it looks like a big V. Okay, let me try this on. Oh, let me give you the info first. And I don't have my glasses here. I do, but I, I don't think I do. Catherine's, it's a 1X WP. I'm going to assume the WP is Women's Plus, and it's also listed as 18 slash 20. 100% rayon, so it's breathable. Not as breathable as cotton, but it is breathable because it has some natural fibers. Rayon has some natural fibers in it, so that's what helps it. And uh, that's it. So I've already worn it several times. I've washed it, dried it, and I'm now going to show it to you on this body. This is wrinkled, and I'm not ironing it. I'm in no mood to iron something. And I love the colors of it. And now I'm thinking the WP might be women's petite. Because um, it's obviously plus. I don't know. It, it's, it's a P in there for something. Either plus or petite. Okay, the neck went more like this. And then, you know, like this. Like, just more straight up. And I just folded that over. And I've been doing that to a lot of the blouses. Instead of cutting it and turning it into a V, I just fold it over and I put a pin on the inside of the other ones because I'm too lazy to do any sewing. And you can see that I just rolled the cuffs and um, yeah, and I might wear this out tonight because it's really hot and this is so cool and comfortable. However, every time I wear it, I've probably worn it like three or four times and probably three or four times in a row. <laughs> yes, I just really liked it when I first got it. 
I would like to take it in a little bit here, do my little trick where I like just, you know, sew and curve it like that. Um, and yeah, it's a little shorter than I like, you know, again, when I washed and dried it, it shrunk a little bit. And I leave the bottom button unbuttoned, you know, I just kind of like it. I kind of like it. So next, let's try something different here. You saw this one in a car vlog and I, uh, I'm going to show it to you now. Let me give you the info on it. If there's any, there's not always info. I do have a tag here, 100% rayon. And, uh, gee, I gotta watch out. <laughs> and, um, but in the bar, I don't care if I lean over like that. That's all okay in the bar. Um, 22, 24 size or 1X. And I don't have a brand name. Tags were cut for that. Okay, trying this one. Okay, I just edited, and this is huge on me. I don't remember it being this big. And I only got this, though, a little while ago. So it must have just been baggy like this, and I just didn't notice. I mean, I don't like it. It looks like a rag right now, and it's wrinkled and all that. So I will definitely be taking this in, and I might not even be wearing it tonight because, I, I don't know, it just looks big. So um, now, for real, I will try this one on. This one has also been worn, but I haven't done any alterations. I wore it in a car vlog. It's like an outdoor shirt, daytime shirt to me, and I certainly could take this one in also, but I'm not overly concerned about it because I'm just wearing it to Walmart and stuff like that. And um, I like the neckline okay. I don't know if there would be some shifting for the bra strap. If anything, I might take that, you know, in the back, my little trick that I do in, in the back, um, where I put a dart back there. But that's it. It's very cool and comfortable, and it's a, you know, really good summer shirt. Now I'm going to try this one on. Another one that I have already worn out and altered. So I will explain the alterations when I try it on. Is that pronounced Kato? C-A-T-O? It's an extra large. And, uh, and that's all I know about it. Oh, no, the fabric content. I, I am sure it's polyester. Um, I do need my glasses for that tiny little print. Um, yeah, 95% polyester and 5% spandex. And I have uh, a couple of shirts like this, I think, in my closet. This style, and I got a bunch from a Genie. So, um, because Jeannie has lost weight, so I'm in the size that she was at one time. And I'm just so thankful to have the shirts, and you will see three of them at the end. And they're all this style, and what I do is I cut the cuff, because the cuff is like rolled and tied back, and I don't like that. And then I alter the neck uh, again with pins. Let me just try it on. I love the print of this one so much. The thing that really sucks about these shirts is they are polyester, so I get fucking hot when I'm dancing. If they're a little loose, it's a little bit better. This one fits me loosely. The other thing is that they're all smocked, and some are more smocked than others. And what I do, and I just don't always have time before I go out, is I will actually uh, sew down. I'll just like fold it over and sew down and I'll do that on the smocks so it holds them flat. And it gives a little kick at the bottom, which I'm okay with. But this is how this one is fitting. And I don't know if the colors are coming in right on my camera, but I absolutely love the print. And we've got the breast pockets. All of these shirts um, have the breast pockets. So again, I just folded this back and I put a pin, a safety pin, one on the top, inside, and it just keeps it open like that. And uh, again, I just cut all that cuff shit that was going on. And I don't even hem that. I just cut it and it's going to be good like that. So this is this one. Let's do this guy next. I know I really liked this shirt. Oh, I can see that the tag has been cut out. I, um, I believe this fits me and I could you know, be seen wearing it in a car vlog when my air conditioning is on. It's a thick, thicker fabric than I would like for summer.
But um, yeah, so I don't know the brand. Let's see what the content is. And that has been cut also. I'm going to guess it's, um, it's probably some cotton in this. Maybe a cotton poly blend. I don't know. Let me try it on. I only paid $1.46 for this top. It does fit. It'll be really nice again for when it's a little bit cooler out. But other than that, I mean, for $1.46, there was no way I wasn't taking this. Let's do this plain black one next. Premise, I don't know, P-R-E-M-I-S-E, -E, Studio, 1X. And uh, let me look at content. I'm hoping it's rayon, and that's why I bought it. 95% rayon, 5% spandex. Just plain, and it is also wrinkled. Let me try it on. Oh yeah, it's just plain black, but I like it. I like the length of it, and it's, you know, the, the little thing that <laughs> that goes like that. I can't think of any of my words. And, uh, you know, black shirt, fake black hair, which has to be dyed. I have a lot of gray. I haven't seen my natural hair in, I don't know, since I was 12. And uh, I see a lot of gray roots. So, anyway, I don't care. I don't care if people have gray hair, but I just like to dye mine. So this is it. Simple. Simple as that. Now let's do this guy that I just liked again because of the colors. This is sort of like the other one. Oh, it is like the other one. See? See how it's like cuffed and that it has this tie? So I take that off. I unroll this as much as I can and I just cut right above that cuff. So I wonder if it's the same brand as the other ones that I have. This one is Ava and Grace. So not the same, but there's a lot that are the same style. And you can see the collar too. That is what... Um, I would be folding back and pinning and I would be undoing that top button also. All right, so let me say that again. Avery and Grace, extra large. I know. I know it's polyester, but let's just confirm that disturbing fact. Cannot read anything on that tag. I'm going with 100% polyester. All right, this one is a little bit more tight on me, on the arms and everything. I would not be able to wear this out dancing. I would die. Uh, I would be taking these cuffs off. And then I'm going to show you the neckline, you know, more up close. See, that's the way most of them are. They have this kind of little collar. And then I just open that and pin. But first I would undo this top button. So let's do that to see. You have no idea how long it just took me to undo that button. <laughs> I'm considering leaving it as a blooper at the end of this video because my nails and I just, the, the, the buttonhole is small. Anyway, so yeah, see, um, I would undo that one and then pin that back and then, and then there's that going on. <laughs> Do stay. I'll, I'll put the little clip, uh, but gee, would, would you even be able to see? I don't know. I'll look when I edit, and then I'll let you know if I'm going to leave that little clip up or not. Um, okay, so yeah, uh, other than that, I like the colors, and I would uh, feel more comfortable if I lose another 10 pounds. This second 10 pounds after the first 100, so I've lost 110, this other 10 that I've been working on, has been going really, really slow, and I'm okay with that. Just letting you guys know that I will still update every time I lose 10 pounds. Now, see, I like the way this one fits better. <gasps> Look, this one's not smart. No wonder I like it better. Yeah, I'm gonna do something more with the other ones that are smocky, because I like this. See, it doesn't, like, kick out and it shows more curve here. And of course, that is easy for me to always curve my shirt, but this hasn't been altered at all. All right, another 10 pounds and this will be golden, like literally. So what's next? Let's do this guy. It's just a regular shirt with a wild and funky print. I don't remember if it fits me or not. Uh, there's no brand name unless it's on another tag inside. Uh, we have the glasses for this one. 100% poly. And I don't see a brand name anywhere. 
I'm sure I purchased this for car vlog purposes. I'm going to leave the blooper. It'll be like right after I say goodbye, but before the end screen. So uh, it took me 40 seconds to undo a button. I think that's a, a long time. <laughs> All right, this shirt. You can actually see through it a little bit. I can see my black bra under there. Um, again, nice little car vlog shirt. I liked the neckline. It's just you know it's it's deep enough and i don't think there's anything that's going to shift oh i see the black bra wanting to sneak through there um the uh strap i just don't i just don't like it it bugs me it's not like i have anything against seeing bra straps because i don't i had somebody complain about my bra straps once they they thought that that was um not disgusting oh what's the there's a word she used um like, it just was so low class of me to show my bra straps. <laughs> it's like it's a fucking bra strap. Get over it. Um, yeah, so this is, this is the shirt. I like it. We have two more of these, and then I will show you the three that I got from my friend. This one, just liked the black and whiteness of it. I know it's going to need some work because I can't remember. I think it's very smocky. Uh, let me see what I got going on here. Oh, it's big. It's a 3X. Um, NV... NVGARD? I think that's what it says. It's very hard to see. And it's a 3X. And let me see the, if it's polyester. I'm sure. I'm sure it is. That friggin' shit going on with the cuff and the tie. The tie back, like it's a curtain or something. And we have 100% uh, and nylon. Let me try it on. Yeah, needs work, but I think it'll be worth working on. It, um, <laughs> it's probably a maternity shirt. I don't know, because it's, it's smocked with a seam here. Like, it's purposely smocked. But I'll be able to, um, I'll be able to take that in, cut the sleeves. That's a very easy fix. And see, see the, this? Now, instead of cutting that, no, I'm just going to pull it back and pin it. I'm just going to pin it. I probably could turn it in if I wanted to, if I ever wanted to do something like that. But, um, yeah, that's just the easiest thing to do. And, uh, yeah, and i got to take care of this, this smocking. I really need to start playing with putting darts in the front or something like that. But I couldn't pass up the black and white. I just like black and white so much. Now, last but not least, I really like this shirt. I almost wore it out the other night when it, I, I knew I wouldn't be dancing. It was a karaoke night, so I probably will. I would like it shorter, though, if I remember right. This is JM Collection Extra Large. Is it Rayon? Please, please let it be Rayon. Yes! 95% Rayon, 5% Spandex. And I just love the colors and, you know, the print isn't my favorite, but, but I just like it. Trying it on uh, right now. I love how this shirt fits, except it's a little too long for me. Look, the sleeves don't even have to be cut. Those sleeves have been cut. I cut the sleeves. I was going to wear them out. I, I, I mean, I don't think anybody else would just cut the sleeves. And, so I had to have done that. Let me go look in my, my uh, fabric trash. Hang on. Yes, I didn't remember that I had done that. See, I cut just that much off. So that shows that I really did want to wear it out. But I can't remember if it was the heat or what. But see, you know, it's not bad. I just, I just prefer my shirts to be more like that length. And I do love that it has the curved hem. I couldn't think of what to call that a little while ago with the black shirt. I don't know, we're calling it a curved hem. <laughs> and, um, but I don't want to take the time to follow that curve. Although I could and still not have to hem it. I could try that. I could just follow the curve and then, and then just leave it unhemmed. Because when I cut shirts and sleeves, if they're knit fabric, I, I'm not sewing that. I, I don't have to. It's never going to unravel. Other than that, I like the colors. It, it, you know, I'm not big on florals, but I think it's the florals are so big that it doesn't just scream 
florals, right? I don't know. I, I, I'm just undecided about, about the length of the shirt. That's it for my thrift store shirts, but now let me show you the three shirts that I got from Jeannie that I altered. Okay, first we have this one. You might have seen it in a picture on my Facebook because I wore it out, I believe, to Hadley's. I sewed these pleats down and I did a little bit of a crooked job at the bottom and, and this kicks out a, in a little weird way now. So I don't know, I'm going to try to do something else maybe to sew that down even more because I don't like that little kick. Like see, I could just do that and then stitch that down. And it won't be like this, you know, this flared there. Um, other than that, I did the same thing. Uh, undid one button, pushed this back, pin inside, cut the sleeves because it had that cuffed stuff going on. Next one. I love this one too. I love the colors. It's like a little bit more casual, which I like. I did sew down some of the pleats and again, I, I'll have to revisit that because some of them I don't like the way they're kicking out at the bottom. And again, I cut the sleeves and I just folded this back, one button undone, pinned. This one I love. I love the colors. It's a floral print, but the colors are so just blended. It just looks like, I don't know, like modeled paint or some abstract art. I don't know. Again, same thing. I just open uh, the collar up and pinned it. One button open and um, has breast pockets. The green one did too. The gold one doesn't. And then I cut the sleeves. And I didn't do anything with the smocking on this one because it was like a last minute thing. And I don't know that I am, I don't know. I think I'd like to try, you know, some of them, you know, this one does have it sewn down. See, it's sewn down for a little bit and then they don't sew it down. So it opens and flares. So I could continue and just sew it down all the way, but it's a little bit of a pain in the ass to do that. So I'm thinking maybe I'll just take in on the sides and just pull more of the front fabric. See how the, see how the, uh, the pleating is gone now. And if I open it, it's not pleating as much as like just ruffled. I don't know. I'll figure something out. But it doesn't have to be completely figured out because I like the shirts no matter what. That's it for the new shirts that I got at the thrift store and then three that I got from Jeannie. I will show you um, more of Jeannie's stuff, like I said, as I wear it. And I'm sure I'll be still shopping at the thrift store because I love the thrift store. So do stick around for the little blooper. You can watch me struggle for 40 seconds trying to um, undo a button. <laughs> I wasn't happy. And thank you so much for watching. I'll be back with more soon. Subscribe. Please subscribe. Blooper coming up right now. Bye. Fuck is fuck this shit. Jesus.